Hello and welcome back to the Project Hercules Diaries. I speak to you today with a sense of relief because a rather complex operation has been completed or at least the first step and the trickiest step. So we're making a replacement cylinder head and we have to cut the ring lands or the grooves that the rings go into. Now that in itself isn't too tricky although they're quite deep and quite thin but the ring itself, this is a piece of broken ring uh, is tapered. You can see there's a five degree taper on each side of the ring and that piece of broken ring fits inside the grooves thusly. So we need to cut that with a five degree taper. The first part would be to plunge in uh, parallel with a straight edged tool and because it's quite deep it's a um, quarter of an inch deep and it's quite a thin groove that was the tricky bit but behind me we have just accomplished that here on the big church of lathe. So we've gone in there we've gone into a quarter of an inch of depth I hope you can see this against the background and we've gone into just about the width of the bottom of that uh, tapered groove on the ring. So the next job is to set everything up here so we can go in at five degrees on either side uh, and not make the grooves too wide so that this fits in there just as nicely as it fits in the original piston behind me. Once we've done that, we're home and hosed, we tidy up this bit here, we drill the mounting holes there, and we'll give it a try just in case the engine can turn it over, rather the starter motor can turn it over, at um, five to one compression. If not, we'll go ahead and fit the decompressor. If it does turn it over, then we just need to fit the spark plugs. So we're not that far away, probably two or three weekends from now, because there's a few of the things going on as well. You saw we're also working in parallel with a little bit of experimentation on fiberglass and uh, the plates that have been laser cut for the gearbox have also arrived. So there's plenty to do, um, but at the moment it's back to work. So probably next weekend, but as usual, thanks for watching and more updates will follow.